Welcome back everyone, Triple M here. Today we're taking a look at the High Dock H1, which is not just an 11 in one docking station, but this is also powered by ChatGPT. Now this has a lot of features, including AI summary, built-in bi-directional noise cancellation. This is meant to capture every details from your meeting, your phone calls, your podcast. High Dock H1 is your go-to for capturing, summarizing, and organizing information. So in this video, we're gonna quickly unbox it. Big shout out to Hi Doc for sponsoring this video. Let's go ahead and jump into it. So before we get it out of the box, just know that this is compatible with your Mac OS or Windows computer via USB-C. This also is compatible with your phones. We'll get into the Bluetooth functions here in a little bit, but if you have an Android or iOS phone, this should work with no issue. As far as a real world situation, this can work with Zoom, with Teams, Google Meets, Discord, FaceTime, WhatsApp, your podcast, anything that comes through the dock, use it as a speakerphone. You can capture that information and summarize it. Let's get this out of the box. All right, so we are gonna have a power supply. This is gonna be 150 watts. We also have a USB-C to C cable, roughly 3.3 feet or a meter long. We have a USB-A to USB-C cable as well. This also comes with an earpiece and this is gonna give you some additional functionality uh, as far as just take in your calls or listen to your audio privately. Uh, how this connects to the dock is pretty sweet. Magnetic, so it just connects to the side, pull right off. So I really like how this connect. No permanent attachment, so you can always take it off or put it back on. And here we are looking at the high dot. Now this is a nicely built system if you ask me. So on the front, we're gonna have the button to answer your call. We have the high dock key, which we'll go into detail here in a little bit. We have the mute and call button. And we also have the volume control, which you can also push down to play and pause video and audio. Now to the left of that, we do have the BNC or the bi-directional noise canceling slider. And we're gonna talk about this, but essentially slide it up and down to kill background noise as well as microphone noise. Now above that, we have the microphone itself. And to the left, we do have our speakers. The speaker is powered by a five watt tweeter. And it also has a seven watt full band driver with one passive vibration diaphragm. So this should give you crystal clear audio and give the person on the other side of the call crystal clear audio as well. Now, as far as some of the specification, this is gonna be able to power and charge your laptop up to 100 watts. You do have the option to charge your cell phone as well. So it supports five volt, three amps and nine volt, two amps. In the dock itself, two HDMI ports for your monitors. Now these are gonna be two 4K 60 Hertz can be connected to this device. We do have a 2.5 gigabit ethernet port as well and a lot of ports for media. So we have one SD card slot, one micro SD card slot, two USB-A, these are gonna be generation one and two. So one's gonna give you 10 gigabits per second, one's gonna give you up to five gigabits per second. Two USB-Cs, both are gonna give you 10 gigabits per second, but one comes 15 to 18 watt charging. We also have an upstream USB-C cable and one DC plug-in. So let's first talk about the ChatGPT powered highlight transcription and summer features. So the high dock is gonna be plug and play, plug into your laptop. As I have it here, I have it plugged in my laptop via USB-C, and then the output, I have two monitors connected. That way the screen is extended. Now this requires no drivers. I didn't have to install anything. It automatically detects it, and it directed me to high notes. So high notes is gonna be the, the main area where the dock interacts with. So you can see on the screen, I do have the option to upload recordings. When you upload a recording, it will go ahead and transcript and summarize it for you. Now below that, you have the high dock. It shows that mine is connected. If you click on it, it's gonna show you all your recordings. Now in order to capture a recording during a phone call, during a meeting, if you listen to something on the dock, all you need to do is press and hold the high dock button for 1.5 seconds. Now when you press it, you'll see the LED light and it will go ahead and start start recording. Now during this time, it's recording everything from both sides and you'll see how it looks here in a little bit, but it really does a good job. Now during the recording, if you wanted to mark a certain spot, maybe it's importance, just something that you can click back to, all you have to do is click the high dock button once and it will go ahead and highlight it for you. So um, how was your um, seminar and events this weekend? The seminar and events went great. Uh, we had a pop-up shop here in Orlando. We were able to really meet the community and uh, have a 
space to our brand. When you're done with the recording, simply hold the button for another 1.5 seconds and it will go ahead and save it. The high dot does have a built-in 32 gig storage and especially dealing with audio files you should have a lot of storage that will last a long time now once your recording is done you go back to high notes you click on the recording and then you can go ahead and have it transcribed now once it's done transcribing you click on it and you can see it does an awesome job showing everything that was discussed on the left side is going to show the conversation and you can see right here it does separate speaker so it has speaker two speaker one so if you're on the phone with somebody else it will show speaker one and speaker two or if you're on a meeting with multiple people it can show all those folks as well so on the left is going to show everything you said verbatim below that you can play it back just to check for accuracy but to the right this is where it summarizes everything guys it tells you the key information the summary the outline action item so this is really awesome for taking your meeting notes and just copy and paste it to where you need it now you also have the option to download it save it share it so a lot of possibilities there and even if there's an error you can go in here and you can manually update it so i, I think this is selling point this is the key feature and i think it works really well and when you're done guys all you need to do is go back to your notes if you want to save it you can or you can go ahead and delete it so let's talk a little bit about the ai base bi-directional noise canceling. Now this is good for getting rid of keyboard clicking, dogs barking, street noise, background noise, or whatever you wanna drown out. And the cool thing about this is that this is BNC, bi-directional noise canceling versus ANC, which is active. And the difference is that BNC is not only gonna filter out the noise that's coming to you, but it's filtering out the mic noise that's going to whoever you're speaking to. This is pretty awesome. And so in order to get this working, guys, there's a red slider on the dock itself. I'm gonna do a demo here in a little bit, but essentially when it's all the way down, everything is normal. When you slide it up, it will start taking that noise out and you can really tell the difference. Let's go ahead and give it a quick test. You know, quarter two is kind of going into the summer months, which, which can be slow. Um, so some of the things that we're going to be implementing is possible collaboration with a local magazine. Well, we, we are really excited about it. We're going to get a page spread um, just talking about everything and hopefully be able to kind of get into the neighborhood that we're not able to just with our regular marketing. Does that work? Yeah. I mean, that sounds that sounds exciting. Uh, how long is the promotion running for? So we're thinking about doing a three month trial with the company. So we're hoping to see in those three months, one, to definitely have it pay for itself and two, just to see, you know, what new leads that we can uh, gain from the more the exposure and hopefully get into more of these communities that we're not able to just through our regular marketing. Now, as far as the E1 earphone, this is an open ear design, can fit on either ear. This enables private conversation through its exclusive protocol. So it gives you the option to walk away, take short breaks without missing anything. So, so how this works is during a call, during a meeting, if you're listening to audio, all you need to do is Lift it from the dock, put it on your ears, and it'll automatically switch the audio over. Now, I did show you guys in the unboxing how this connects to the dock. I think this is really sleek. It is just a magnetic design, so you can simply pull it off or you can put it back on. Works really well. Now, on the earpiece itself, there are two buttons. So the button up top is gonna be your record button. All you need to do is long press for two seconds and it will start recording. During the recording, if you wanted to add a mark, important part during the conversation, simply click it once and it will add that marker for you. To stop recording, simply hold it for another two seconds and it will stop. Next input on that is the actual earbud itself. So <laughs> this area that looks like a fingerprint, this has an action attached to it. So long press for two seconds, it will mute. Long press again, it will unmute. Double tap to answer a call or double tap to hang up. A lot of input there. And I think it was a great addition for this device. So we've been testing this for a couple of days now, and this has been pretty awesome. I've been using it a lot. Pretty 
accurate in my opinion. It just has a lot built in with all the inputs. Two-way noise cancellation, which is a great addition in my opinion, but the transcription and integration with ChatGPT just really puts this over the top. If I had one negative, I would say is that the headphone itself can be hit or miss doesn't fit really well on my ears. Sometimes I feel like it's not all the way in, but it does work in a pinch, but I don't see myself using the headphones that much. As far as the dock itself, it comes in two colors. It comes in a platinum gray and a slay gray. Now with the purchase of the high dock, you also get free lifetime subscription to their transcription service. If you're interested in this, I'll go ahead and leave a link in the description. Let me know your thoughts on the concept. This is something that's totally different. I definitely see where it's going. It definitely has a place useful in my opinion and i will keep on testing it to see how it performs as time goes along so let me know your thoughts in the comments if you're new to the channel subscribe smash the notification bell thank you for watching and i'll catch you on the next one